Well, it's going to be hard, I think, for any team in that first series to come into Kauffman Stadium with that atmosphere and be loose and easy. Would you yeah, guys agree? I would agree yes. wholeheartedly. And, you know, also, that's why they're continuing to push to get their best record overall mm -hmm. so they can have home field. It's a great record to push for. I mean, it was it was pretty loud in Anaheim. It was pretty loud in Baltimore, but it wasn't anything close to Kauffman Stadium. It was the closest to Kauffman Stadium was San Francisco, and it wasn't just because that was a World Series. Apparently, we don't go there very often. You did, HUD, more for interleague play with the Angels at that is more the norm. I mean, it's just a wild ballpark, but there was nothing like Kauffman yeah. Stadium. Well, I will say this. I think that the wild card Royals of last year are a much better team than whoever the wild card team or teams are this year. I think there's a, a discrepancy now. Talent, uh, just team concept, good team. Royals last year were a very good wild card team. I don't think you're going to see as good a quality a wild card team or teams this year. That's just my opinion. Well, last year the Royals finished 16 games above 500 to go to the wild card. If the season ended today, your two wild card teams would be 14 games over 500. Ah, they're doing the circle of life here. Simba Cam. In St. Petersburg and Slugger in the house and I think over my shoulder I hear Lorenzo Cain 